What's going on everybody? I thought I'd give you a quick video to show how you can make a menu item or any type of item in Elementor sort of float, float or hover above other content. So let's just show you what I'm talking about. On this website right here, when we scroll down the menu right here, it sort of follows us and it floats above everything else. And no matter how far we go down the page, it sticks and it follows us. And that's a, that's a feature that I'm, that I'm sure some people out there would like to achieve in Elementor as well. So I'm going to show you a very quick and easy way to do exactly that. So I have a, a pre-made Elementor template right here that I found in the Elementor library. So let's just say that I'd like a menu on top here and I would like that menu to sort of follow me as I said when I go down the page. So in order to do that, we just add a new section. It's a regular section right here and we add a menu as I'm sure you guys are familiar with from before. I'd like the menu to be centered and make sure to stretch the section if you want it to be displayed in the center right here. Now, if I go back to the page and I scroll down, as you can see, the menu stays on the top of the page, which can be pretty annoying if you just like it to, to follow you. So for different reasons, I'm sure. So let's say that I'd want this to be having a white background color just to make it clean. And I want the content to be positioned in the middle now it looks pretty good. And in order to achieve the effect that I'm talking about, we're gonna go back to the advanced tab right here, or to the advanced tab right, right, right here, and we're gonna set the C index higher than the content that it'll sort of follow, right? So to make the, the menu item float, we go down to the custom CSS area, and I have some code right here that I've, uh, that I've written, and I'll make sure to share that, you, share that with you guys in the description paste that in and as you can see right now it'll follow you when you go down the page however notice that when you come down here it it disappears behind this this image right here because i'm pretty sure that that image image has a higher c index set than the menu or the section that the menu is in so it's one right here so we're going to have to make sure to adjust the c index uh, right here so let's just bump it up to five for good measure and now when you scroll down Everything is floating, the menu is floating above everything, so it works the way that we want it to. It's pretty cool, isn't it? And I guess that's it. I'll make sure to, to share the code with you guys, and uh, have a good day. Cheers.